Clint from 50 Campfires here. I am excited to get out today in the Advanced Elements Ultralight Kayak. What's cool is that I have everything on me right now to go and spend a day out on the water. Kayak only weighs about 17 pounds. Paddles in the back, which is great. Got my life jacket, pump right here. I'm gonna go ahead and set it up. The goal here isn't to get all the way pumped up full. The goal here is to get the kayak to start to take a little bit of shape so it's easier to put the floor in. All in all, it takes about five minutes. Uh, the only real tip that makes it a lot easier is to make sure uh, that you inflate the two chambers up about halfway so the kayak kind of starts to take its form and then stop. And then it's easy to put the floor in and you got a little brace in front here that you pop in. And then you just, a couple more pumps and it's ready to go so let's hit the water. The verdict. Been out here for a couple hours in the Advanced Elements Ultralight Kayak, and I have to say that I'm impressed. I am very, very impressed. I've been kayaking for a long time. My wife and I spent a lot of time on the water in Minnesota. Great state to spend time on the water. And this is my first time in an inflatable kayak. I've been curious about them for a long time. First thing I'll say is that I'm blown away by the stability of this thing. There are two, just because of its design, there are two air chambers on the side and I would really have to work hard to get this thing to flip over. It's incredibly stable. So I think it would easily accommodate the entire range of skill levels. If you're a little bit nervous about getting on the water in a smaller craft, this would be absolutely perfect for you. So let's talk about the stats a little bit on this kayak. It's 17 and a half pounds, so that makes it very easy to get around and be mobile out on the water because you're not really pushing that much weight around. Uh, it's 10 and a half feet long. It is 32 inches wide, which is, which is pretty standard for uh, or sort of a kind of recreational kayak. It is, it'll support 225 pounds, which is fantastic. The paddle is in four parts. I'm used to, of course, having my, all my kayak, uh, kayak paddles are in two parts. It, four parts, obviously, and it packs down in the bag very nice. I wasn't sure about how it would be in terms of being rigid, uh, being a four-part paddle, but it's fantastic. It is solid as a rock, so that part I'm very happy with. As you saw when I was putting it together a little bit earlier, we have a brace that goes across here, and then we have a bar that slides in. So that keeps us up to a little peak, so water is going to bead off in each direction. You're not gonna have any problem with it pooling on the front. And I'm just, I'm really impressed with how comfortable it is. The way the kayak is set up, you're sort of sitting right on the floor of it. You do put a floor in, it's maybe, you know, it's a quarter inch, half inch of, of uh, foam rubber on the bottom. And so when you are paddling across the lake, you can feel just a little bit of the waves on the bottom side of the kayak. And I actually found that to be kind of cool because you're a little bit more connected to the lake in that way. It's not uncomfortable at all. Very, very impressed. Uh, if you're just looking at getting out on the water, if you live in town and you don't have anywhere to put a kayak, uh, if you are tired of hoofing a big heavy kayak up on top of your car to get it or SUV on the rack, uh, something like this would be such a good option for you. So this is the Advanced Elements Ultralight Kayak.